Hey YouTubers, Xander here. Welcome back to Terraria 1.3.4.4 Point Expert. Last time, uh, we changed things up a bit. We're gonna focus on fo- uh, focus on focusing? Stumbling over my words as per usual. Focus on fishing. And so, I'm actually gonna move some stuff around, I think. Can I? I cannot. Okay, unfortunately, as nice as it was having the safe there, if I want to be able to put both of these down, I need to put them over here. Because I want to put them next to each other so I can just go boop boop and walk out. Uh, as for where to put the safe now, I guess I'll just stick it in here. Why not, right? I guess I'll put the sunflower back even though it's more or less useless. Um, I'll just hang on to that. Alright, so let us talk to the Angler. Because we need a quest for the day. So we need a unicorn fish. Our hollow's this way, where am I going? I'm thinking of my other file. Just because of your money. So now we need to find a body of water. A larger body of water. <laughs> Crud. Am I going to have to make one? Ah, hang on a moment. I can't see a damn thing. All right, um, let's get all of our potions out. We're gonna need that if we're going down there, because down there is not friendly. Okay. Oh, hello, worm. That can be used as bait. Uh. Let's get something else set up real quick as well. Just a workbench. One of those. Decrease the spawn rates while we're down there. I guess I'll just quickly do this again. So now we can have two of these guys for 10 minutes, which in theory should help out a lot. clear out this because the way the fishing works is you need to have a straight body of water all right so see the problem with this is like all this area will not count towards it I think well it might oh yeah now it will definitely So that all that will count towards. Oh! Whoa! Did the spiders do that? God dang! Spiders are vicious. All right. Um. So let's block this off. Block this off. And 
then we can do this. No, we can't because this is in the way. Need to hurry. Wasting precious sonar here. And here we go. Alright. So we need to wait for a very specific... There. <laughs> That's all we needed. But we're going to keep on fishing anyways because why waste the sonar potion? We don't want bass though because there's only two things that'll come from bass and it's a weaker version of the pumpkin pie that we make. So we'll hold out for hopefully other stuff. Princess fish makes people fall in love. That was a useless one. I've been doing a lot of fishing lately so I'm pretty decent at knowing what does what. Unfortunately we're not down deep enough to find the armored cave fish, which I believe is the one that does the 10% mitigation to damage. Ooh, wooden crates. Crates are always a plus. Uh, those can give us randoms up. Oh, that was just stupid and money. Um, bombfish are literally just bombs. Uh, but crates can contain a lot of random stuff, especially because we're in hard mode. It can actually contain... Ah, oh, the line broke. Uh, it can actually contain ores and bars from... Damn it, it broke again. From the... Thank you. Hard mode stuff. So we can actually get, like, titanium or calcum, stuff like that. But it can, more importantly, contain bait. Oh. Oop, I didn't mean to catch that, actually. Holy shit. I've never actually caught one of those. I shouldn't have... Oh, I have no bait now. Alright. Well, we have to hope. Obsidian skin potion. Alright, we got an apprentice. We have one bait from that. Nope, stop. There we go. We don't want princess fish. We don't want bass. We want a wooden crate. And we got... We got a shine potion and more bait from it. So that works out. Nope. Oh, the sonar potion wore off. Alright, well let's head back. That's usually our head back time. <laughs> so we need to go talk to the angler now. She's all the way up here. Yeah, he's in the pumpkin house. Oh, no way. Oh. Oh, fuck. I thought that was going to be something completely different. I thought it was something that would summon the pirate invasion. So, I was extremely disappointed. Let's see. Oh, we got the tsunami in a bottle, though, which is good. Allows us to double jump. So, we sell it. <laughs> Presumite, though. I feel like that makes a really good potion. I don't care about the bass, don't care about that. Is this a gold or platinum map? It's gold maps so though, I'm gonna sell those. Get some more calcum, that can go down there now. I mean... <sighs> Let me just double check real quick. Yeah, it's all right. It's money. That's exactly what that is. That is money. So, so, what does the prismite do? Oh. Ashee! 
see. Um, well, that's pretty good. It's, 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 it's pretty good. Well, I'll make that moon glow, shiver thorn, water leaf. Moon glow, shiver thorn, water leaf. I have never in my life wanted the 30% to work more, ever. And it didn't. Oh fuck. That's fine though. We just got something that would give us plus 80 health. And I like spat a little as I did that. <clears throat> I'm like, I'm drooling because I'm so excited. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll just do that. Okay. So let's go underground now because I'd like to get some cave fish. Have a pet? Oh, it's just it's the lantern. Wait, where's my truffle? There we go. He provides light. Let's see. So what we need to do is first dig out this area. Because the way it works is it takes the sur from what I gathered is it takes the surface of the water, aka right this line right here, and goes down. So these this water actually doesn't count towards the like hole the fishing hole portion so we need to do stuff like this not just drain it but also level it out I guess Got to get used to the fact that I also can't breathe underwater anymore. Oh god, how much water am I draining into this? A lot of water! Okay, that's... a oh, whoops. These guys are vicious. <laughs> so let's lock that off. Let's kind of block this off. Now, in theory, stuff should have a difficult time of reaching us. Yeah, I know I'm draining it a little bit, but I need to flatten it out. It's... It's important! Oh, motherfucker! Whoa! Hang on. Okay, you, sir, need to die. Shit! Damn it, that thing, holy crap! That just decimated me. 
There was not much I could do about that. Also, look at all these enemies. Holy shit. Kerr. But that sucked. Um, I got one more Night Owl potion left. Let's see how easy it is to find that fishing spot now. There it is. <laughs> get out of here with that shit. You get out of there with that shit. Okay, um... Okay. Really? Okay, the other thing I realized that I want to do is make this a perch. Oh, dear lord. Okay, um... We kind of need to get back to the surface. So good thing I didn't pop any potions yet, but also, holy crap, we're in for a treat. I can't see a goddamn thing. Alright, so we want to do this. No, 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 not that, though. I didn't want to drain a bunch of the water. just want to make it so that if something pops down here, they can't jump up and get us. And then the spiders could kill them. All right. Oh, boy. I am not ready for this. Let's go. Quickly turn on the security system. That's not part of the security system. Oh my god, all these doors are open. That's bad. I don't have... Ivan has left. Who the fuck is Ivan? Okay, so now we're dealing with two things at the same time. We're dealing with a solar eclipse and slime rain. I need to turn on the secondary portion of the... Okay, there we go. Cool. Might be because of the slime rain, but stuff is not spawning nearly as frequently as I expected it to. There's a vampire out there. <gasps> Was that 1500 health I just saw? Yeah, could you do me a favor and like die? second that thing turns human, I'm fucked. I'll smash through the door and I won't be able to do anything about it. I could... I'm gonna seal the doors. I 
I gotta do this. This is like, this is a very dangerous event. And I'd say it might be worse than the, well, I don't know. Maybe it's not worse than the goblin attack just because of the fact that nothing's like breaking into the houses yet. And I say yet. Because I know there's vampires and vampires can break in. I have no idea where that vampire even went. So now there's only one entry into the house. Oh, are all the slimes stuck on the sky bridge? No. Okay. Got me. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Hi, slime. Really, get out of here. Nobody likes you. Oh, that's uh, that's bad too. Just die, please. No, 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 no! Get out of there! Freaking spider knocked back and pushed him back onto the platform when he instead he was gonna fall. It's actually a lot more tame than I expected it to be. It it must be because of the slime rain. Or just actually that peace candle is doing a job. Oh, that's a... Get down there, bitch. Shit. That is doing work. <laughs> so as long as I make sure that I use my own knockback to push them off the ledge, I think it should be fine. I don't know why there aren't a bunch of vampires spawning, but I'm gonna the fuck. Oh, the Eyesore. Just freaking shot out like 80 damage. I feel like my base needs a uh, hidden honey pool just so I can get an extra. I can just dig it down right here. Put a little honey pool I can just like sink down in. Fill that with honey. <laughs> Just drown in it. <laughs> oh, you're gonna break in. And immediately get attacked by spiders. I bet you regret that decision now, don't you? Let's 
go check on the slime situation, I guess. Like, are there slimes above here? Oh boy. Alright. Hi! I really didn't want to fight you right now. Like, on top of everything else that's going on. But I guess you're not going to take no for an answer, so... I'm just going to pee on you a lot. Alright, no more slime rain. Which means, yeah, these guys are going to start coming full force. There's an Izor. Creature from the deep. Oh, duh, I guess I could be using... Uh, that's a vampire! <laughs> Get decimated! Two Nimbus shower, or Nimbus rods plus the... Oh, my fuck. Plus the two spiders and the golden shower just... Oh, hello. <gasps> I think we can make really good wings from that. Like, possibly better than the D-Town wings? I don't know. Gotta say, that has gotta be a satisfying... That is, like, just a huge satisfying sound. <laughs> Oof. Look at all that money down there just waiting to be collected. Alright, we're gonna deactivate that just for a moment so I can do this. Okay, we can go around. Thirteen gold from that? Okay. Just kinda hoping for more, but can't be too greedy. Okay, I think I have all those already. Yeah, I do. Sell that, sell that, sell that, hang on to that, sell that, sell those, that and that, and I really don't care about copper ore or silt. Might hang on to that though. I already have one of those, and I don't care about that. Uh, let him in. There was two. Nimbus Rod, Nimbus Rod. Oh shoot, there's a swamp thing trapped in there. My bad, sorry dude. I mean, you're gonna die pretty much regardless, but... So it only goes on during the day, so we just got two and a half more in-game hours, I guess? Where am I even? It's just because I'm... Oh, shit! Oh, that's bad! How did you even get inside? I, like, don't even know how that guy got into the house. That's, like, ridiculous. Still have two spiders, right? Okay. 
Just kind of want to make sure. Because those things are wrecking house, so... Because I, I guess that is one major improvement over from them over the... The demon imps. And that is because they cling. Whereas the minions were very slow and had to actually hit their mark. These things will cling. Ooh. That's a moonstone. I need that. That can combine with something that I can't remember off the top of my head to create a celestial stone which gives us stat boost on both day and night. That would actually be really good and probably would replace the warding uh, shield of Cthulhu once we got it going. So wings will replace that, then uh, we still need those two though. Maybe not that, but... Actually no, the increased invincibility frames are good. Alright, Solar Eclipse is almost over. And it's done. Just gotta kill everything that's currently... Alright, so that guy's free now. Oops, I should probably... Let us see. Hooey. We're rich. And I'm hungry apparently. Alright, for now I'm just gonna do this. Um I need to figure out something later for that. A security system that so like once we go in lockdown mode, it'll also lock down all the doors except for. See, oh well. <sighs> See, the problem is, is I forget that I can't access the other floors like that. I built this, I, the design of this house is absolutely atrocious. Shit. I'm sorry Dora, I didn't mean it. Because the way I have my other house and most of my houses that I've always made is there'd be a central pillar with rooms on either side going all the way up. So basically from inside the house you can access the entire structure. And in this one you have to access all floors individually. I'm wondering is if, what about approximately here, so like right next to the table, I took out two, two of each block and put an active stone block there that would be connected to the lever. So that when I flip the lever, those will all clear out, become inactive, and I can just easily fly up between all the floors while still inside the house and then on the outside of each door I can put an inactive that would become active and block off. So, similar to how these two switch. This feels like something I'd want to do. So I can use this to make bat wings. But I don't think they're as good as D-Town's wings. I want to talk to you again actually. 
Yeah, I need to know where to get the Sunstone, because a Celestial Stone. Minor increase in damage, melee speed, critical strike, chance, life regen, defense, pick speed, and my minion knockback. And that can actually be combined further with something, as I found out. Um, and created in my other file. I can't remember what I combined it with, but it combined with something and made something neat. Um, there's our, there we go, there's the accessories slot. Uh, bah. I only need one of those, I just found out, actually. So I'm pretty sure the bat wings are not as good as D-Town's wings. I'll look that up in between the episodes just to make sure. I guess I should hang on to these for now. Oh, wait, safe's inside the house now. Got it. Quick stack. Quick stack. We are rich, which means we're going to... Try yet again. To get warding. Damn, still not right. Okay. Well, we are definitely over time for today. Um, so, yeah, unfortunately, most of this day was dedicated to the freaking solar eclipse, because, of course, that had to happen. We didn't even really get any fishing done. We got a fishing area set up in order to catch the armored cave fish, which is used to create a potion that will increase our... basically mitigate 10% of damage taken. Uh, so, yeah, it's good. Very good potions that we'll need to be making. So in the next episode, I would like to fully focus on fishing. I guess I'll need to make more potions at the same time. But hopefully once we get enough potions made, we'll be able to take on the twins again. And this time be a little bit more successful. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And I guess I will see you next time.